Um, not added anything like, uh, what's it called? Now then everybody, welcome to another brew day. This brew day is somewhat different to the previous brew days and I'm not making a beer, I'm making a turbo cider. Now, regular viewers of the channel will know, I decided to do this a while back when um, my then fiance, now wife, discovered some juice that she really liked to drink. So I thought I'd ferment it out and see what it tastes like as a cider. So let's get to the juice, shall we? So, this is the stuff. Um, <clears throat> Corston Press, uh, Apple and Ginger, and Beetroot. Now, I'm reliably informed that the uh, best ratio for this is one part uh, beetroot juice to four parts apple and ginger juice. So that's exactly what I've got. I've got one of these and four of these. I'm going to make one gallon of this cider. So um, this should be fairly straightforward. Let's get to it. So very simple. All the juice is going to go in there. And then I'm going to dump the yeast in. Easy as pie. This has all been sanitised. Um, I'll take a gravity reading and we'll see what we've got. So let's get to it. So there, it's done. Everything's in. I took a gravity reading, almost exactly 1050. I'm pleased about that. Um, the yeast I'm using is just um, Young's cider yeast that I picked up from the local homebrew shop. Um, one thing I will say about this recipe is quite expensive. The cartons of juice were two quid a pop. So that's 10 quid of juice just to make one uh, gallon of turbo cider so not the cheapest good job I love my wife really also I am quite interested to see how it ferments out and what it tastes like as a final product not really added anything like tannins or acids or anything like that just gonna ferment everything out because it's got beetroot in it, it should be all right I think but we'll see so that's it end of the brew day um, all done in about 20 minutes so, I suppose it's, nice. it's got that going for it, and I bet than a five hour brew day to brew a beer. Keep checking the homebrew Wednesdays to see how the cider's getting on. Nothing left to say, except for please give the video a like and a thumbs up. Always appreciate it when you guys interact with me via thumbs up and comments. Really appreciate that. Go visit the Twitter page and please go visit the Facebook page. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the great brewing content I've got coming up. And cheers for checking me out.